Good morning. I want to show you a quick um, tool we have on Lotus Notes if you need to send a similar type message time after time, uh, particular when you're doing your attendance sheets. Um, unless you have a large class, this might not be as useful, but uh, for smaller classes, particularly if your class is usually all there every day, um, you don't want to go through writing a brand new email. So what you want to do is create stationery. So we're going to go from a mailbox, we're going to go to tools, and then down to stationery. And we're going to create a new stationery. You can use either message, which should be generic, personal, you have more customizable fields. But for this case, you can play with that on your own. But for this case, we're just going to do message to for this case, since it's attendance, CFOT attendance. Okay. Subject. Now, for our attendance, we've been told from the subject line, use our class. So, BS 102 would be the Old Testament class, O to T, uh, just to indicate specifically which class it is. And then I'm going to say all present. Now, any day that my class is, everybody's there, I'm all set to go. I can open this up at the beginning of my class on my laptop once I'm sure everybody's there and uh, send that right out. But what we're going to do is we're going to save this and we're going to save it as PS102 all present. Okay. So the next time that I need to send this email, I'm going to go down here to tools, stationary, and save it as a memo. BS102 all present, double click on that. Everything's all set up. Hit send, and you're all set. If you needed to change this, if that day there was somebody not there, you still have at least part of it done. You just need to change your all present uh, to the correct report, tell who was late, tell who was absent, and send it on its way. But this should save you in a minute or two, maybe a couple minutes, if you really just don't want to open emails to begin with. But this will move you along and uh, make your life a little easier. And like I said, you can use it for other things as well. If there are forms that you're typically sending to people, a form email, you can save it in there, and then you just need to change the email address or the uh, name or particular detail. Uh, enjoy that. Uh, play with it and see how you can